Hey, what's good guys? Easy Tech 231 here. And if you've been following the channel for some time, you've probably seen a lot of these here on the channel. These are just regular power banks. These are some awesome power banks from Anchor, but um, they're just normal looking power banks. And then just recently, I picked up these guys. These are some really interesting looking power banks. These are the ME MIMO 10,000 milliamp hour power banks. I have a dedicated video on these, so if you want to check that out, I'll put that in the description as well. These are some really interesting looking, but awesome power banks at the same time. But I've been on a mission to check out some of the most interesting power banks out there. And I recently came across these guys. These guys here are called the Jewel Intelligent Power Banks from Mexico also known as the cobblestone on the website that I found them at. Uh, but these are really cool. Don't worry, I'll put these in the description as well. You can get them in a bunch of different colors. I have four here, as you can tell. But also, as you can tell, these don't look like any normal power banks here. And that's why I'm showing you guys these power banks here today. So I'm going to go ahead and open up one of these here just so you guys can get a closer look at these power banks. These things are really, really cool. Uh, but as far as presentation goes, it's really nice. Very solid box here. I mean, what are you going to do about that? The power bank here is really interesting. I, I mean, that there's nothing else that I can really use to describe this, uh, but it does come with a really nice braided micro USB cable, probably like a three inch or a six inch micro USB cable here, but it's nice that they included that. It seems to be really nice, high quality. And then getting to the power bank here, I'm just going to call them the cobblestones. This is the cobblestone power bank, 5,200 milliamps. And I will get into further specifications in a little bit. But overall, I was really impressed with the way that these things are crafted, I guess you can say. Um, it's not super duper premium. It's it's not super light it doesn't feel hollow but it's not really heavy or anything like that i just get a closer look right there um it's really really interesting I, I just like the way these things look another really cool thing about these power banks is that they fit really well in your hand i know that you don't really carry power banks around with you like this all the time but you know i just found that it's really satisfying it's really nice ergonomic wise also like i said before you can get these in eight different colors i have four of them here and what i do like about these is that they do all come with their own uh, specifically colored micro usb cable so that's a nice touch it's not all just silver or black or anything like that yeah that's the presentation so that's cool so in terms of overall hardware you're not looking at a whole lot in terms of buttons and ports or anything like that you do have a three dot led indicator here to tell you how much power is left in the power bank itself then you have the input for the actual power bank you have the output for the power bank to charge your devices and you have the button here for the led indicator and to get it running so i got it plugged into my galaxy s7 edge here and i gotta say this is this is really interesting i've never seen anything like these before i will say that this cable is really nice um the plugs are actually gold plated so that's a nice touch and then of course it's a braided cable it seems to be really nice high quality and um, as far as a build quality for the power banks if i had to give it a rating from one to five i'll probably give it a three and a half to four they're not the most solid things out there um, they could probably take a couple drops. They are nice and solid feeling, but if I were to press on them a little bit, you would start to hear them creak a little bit. So that's something to take note of. But overall, if you drop it, it should be just fine. These power banks also have what you call power IQ technology. So um, that protects from overcharging, uh, overheating and short circuiting. So that's a nice touch as well. Um, so overall, it's a really solid power bank. I did not mention the price. The price is actually 30 bucks. Yes, it's 30 bucks. Um, again, I'll put links for these in the description so you can check them out. I think, in my opinion, these are definitely worth 30 bucks. Um, I think if they were 39.99, I'd probably say, eh, look elsewhere. But I think at 30 bucks, it's definitely worth it uh, for a 5200 milliamp hour battery. Also, I mean, let's just look at them. They look really cool. <laughs> I mean, it's an acquired taste. Some people may think, oh my goodness, what in the world is that thing? Uh, but it's just something different. I think it's worth a look. Um, they do have them in all white and one in all, bla bla all black. I'll probably give these away. Um, maybe do a Twitter giveaway. I don't know. But I'll definitely be picking one up in black and then one in white because I just think they're cool to have around. Uh, just something to look at. Very similar to these guys here. Uh, so um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed these power banks as much as I did. I actually think they're nice. Uh, but uh, leave your thoughts on these power banks down below. Slap the like button if you like this video. Follow me on Twitter at EasyTech231. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.